So, after 3,774 days on GTA 5 and almost two years of modding experience, I noticed that the GTA 5 gunplay became very boring and repetitive. So after two years of experimenting with different combat mods, I have finally mastered it. In this video, I'm bringing y'all the best GTA 5 combat mods that are out right now to achieve the ultimate realism when in gunfights. So first off, we are starting with my personal favorite, which is Realistic Euphoria. It changes the overall ragdoll system of the game and makes gunshots feel much more dangerous. NPCs now collapse to the ground when you shoot them in the head, instead of some other mods that have them stumble away. This gives it a much more realistic feel. They also now hold on to their wounds, making it look like they are trying to survive instead of just dying at non-critical hits. There is honestly too much to cover on what this mod really does, but it is definitely an essential if you are aiming for realism. Next up on the list, we got a very hardcore mod that changed the game a lot. I'm talking about realistic blood effects. This changes everything related to blood decals in the game. For people who don't know what blood decals is, I'ma explain what this mod does. It basically changes accurate wound size, accurate blood pool size, accurate splatter size, and my personal favorite, realistic soaking which basically makes blood soak into your clothing after being shot. There's a lot more that this mod changes, but I'ma just leave some pictures up on the screen and you tell me if that's realistic or not, man. Hey, man, I'm sorry for interrupting the video, but I forgot to tell y'all something. If y'all want these mods, y'all gonna have to join my Discord server. I'ma put a Google Doc that has all these mods in one list so y'all can all download them. Alright, let's get back into the video, man. Now, for the third mod we got is Morgul. Now, this mod changes everything. Because when this mod came out, I was gassed to show y'all. I even made my first ever showcase video on it. Alright, let me give y'all an example of how this mod really works. Basically, when you shoot somebody in vanilla GTA, no blood spilling comes out. But this mod changes that. If you shoot somebody in the leg, blood will come out of his leg. If that makes sense basically a must-have bro but i'm not gonna get into what all this does because there's a better creator that did a showcase video on this i'm pretty sure i'm gonna put it on the screen right here i suggest you go watch that video he does a very good job at explaining what this mod really does and all its features because it has a bunch more features like bleeding out and being hit with a car and shit but y'all gonna have to check that out because you feel me this ain't no showcase this is just me telling y'all what the best mods is the mod I'm about to show you comes with a lot of features that improve the overall feel of the guns. Now this was an interesting one because I've been experimenting with these mods a long time ago. I've been doing this for a long time and it's safe to say that I finally found the most realistic one, realistic weapon play. Now realistic weapon play, there's a lot of things so I'm gonna just put the change logs on the screen for y'all right now. I'm also going to be demonstrating how it works with bullet penetration and stuff like that. Because personally, I think that's very important in realistic weapon play mods, and this one does it very well. Now, as you can see here, bullets still go through metal and wood surfaces, but when it comes to thicker objects, the bullet won't go through, which is really realistic to me. I like it personally, but you don't have to download it since it's an optional file. But I wouldn't understand if he wouldn't download it because like who the f doesn't want this. So this mod comes with another add-on that a lot of y'all been asking me for. And I'm finally revealing it. Look, these sparks are also in this optional file mod. So if you want these sparks after shooting metal services and things of that nature, make sure you download this man. Now on to the next mod, we got realistic sound effects. Now look. In gunplay, I feel like the vanilla version, the guns sound like toys. They are ass. I don't like them at all. So we have to get rid of them. How do we get rid of them? With this mod right here. Hey, I'm telling you, this is the best one out right now. Right now, because I know there's updates coming from Chris, and he got some heat on the way. But I'm going to tell y'all about that in the other video. But hey, look, man. If you want the most realistic sounds, go with this one. I'm finna just let y'all hear it so y'all can hear for yourself. Yeah, 
Yeah, man. If y'all want to hear the rest of the video, I'm going to just put the link in the description so y'all can hear the full video. But yeah, I, I think you got the point. That shit was pretty loud and it's pretty realistic. All right, let's go on to the next mod. So the next mod is a glass overall. So this is not really an essential, but it's just if you want the ultimate, ultimate realism. Every aspect is going to matter. Every little detail is going to matter. You feel me? So I did a little demonstration here. Y'all can just see for yourself. I'm going to just let the gameplay speak for itself. Hey man, that was the end of the video. I hope y'all enjoyed this video, man. Make sure you like, make sure you subscribe, and tell me if y'all need a part two, because I got way more combat mods for y'all, man. This ain't it. Hey, let me know if I should upload a part two if y'all like these mod showcases. Oh, uh, yeah, man. That was Matrix, and I'm out.